Maybe I should have worked harder in college, so that I can at least understand a thing or two from the conversations. Don't worry, Jennifer. I don't understand any of what they said either. You are not alone. I'm here with you. My hair color gives away who I am. I'm a silly blondie. Don't speak of yourself like this, Jennifer. You're not silly. You're smart. You make your own movie with the script you wrote by yourself. You're pretty and kind, and you're the best person I've ever known. Please don't hate yourself. Fine, I get it. But can you let go of my hand first? You're hurting me a bit. Oh, sorry. Uh, are you going to be okay? Shall I get you some ointment for these red areas on your hand? <laughs> You're funny. I'm not some glass doll that breaks for being held too tightly. <laughs> oh, I can barely breathe. You were great fun. You're smiling. Did I make you... happy? This is good. <laughs> uh, don't you find me weird? My attitude changes so rapidly. I've been mean to you for a long time, and all of a sudden I start to follow you around and try to use you to survive from this. Weird? What's so bad about that? Even if you're weird, it's a good kind of weird. I like you. Staying by my side. Even if I'm a benefit-driven fence-sitter who immediately embraced Arcanist after being ditched by my human friends? Jason and Michael shouldn't hate you, if they knew you better. <sighs> You seem to really like me. <sighs> you would jump off the car to rescue me. You protect me, praise me. You would even be happy because I was happy. Because I've never seen anyone as pretty as you are. You're special. You're different to the rest of us. Oh, stop. I'll not be embarrassed for these nice things you said about me. I've heard enough of them throughout my entire life. Listen, I'm very sorry for mistreating you, and I'm grateful that you came to save me. I will reward you with a secret. My secret. Do you want to hear it? Absolutely. I'd love to. They believed I'm a dumb bimbo. Believed that I hate books. I led a life they want me to have. Till I graduated from high school. I don't like these people. You shouldn't have been put through this. You are the smartest person I've ever known. If one day I run into them, I will pull their noses and mouths off. Like this! <sighs> A wonderful idea. I wish I was as creative as you are. This is the last surprise I prepared for you. Now, enjoy! No! Please don't go! Please stay here! I will get you the best beds, honey, and fruits. I will search for foods for you. I will take the responsibility to take care of you. 
Jessica, we will not stay. Now listen to me carefully. No, I hate living alone. Well, come with me. I will get you a beautiful house much better than the one you have here. I will show you around restaurants, shopping malls, and discos. We can have fun in so many places. I will also get you a room right in our house. I don't care whether my parents allow this or not. <gasps> Jennifer. I really want to be with you. But I don't want to leave here. I have no desire for the outside world. I will quickly reveal this true love of mine. And people will look at me as if I've done something wrong. I don't like that. I hate when my power gets weakened. I... I want you to stay... here... with me. If I say I could stay... Timekeeper! Jessica, if I stay, what will you get me, except for food and shelter? What else will you get me? Will you? If you stay, I will share my critter friends with you. Along with my cave, my keys, my little buttons, anything you want. Sounds great. We will definitely have great fun. No, I won't allow it! Sincere ones? Any wishes? I will make your wish come true. When you were Anne, you asked what my wishes were. Now I know the answer. I know what I want. It's you.